the more personal aspect of who Harvey Clay also is. Okay, let's do it. Okay. So earlier today, you told me you love to multitask. Yeah. And a lot of you multitask, but not this kind of multitask. <laughs> to give you guys an example, Harvey will listen to music, watch a TV series, talk to someone on the phone, do schoolwork, and who knows what else, <laughs> all at the same time. How do you do that? How? <laughs> well, because I find myself resting most of the time, so when I actually have time to do something, I'd like to, I don't know, it's just, I can't keep myself focused on one thing. Yeah. So, I always find myself um, playing my Nintendo Switch while watching a TV series and uh, while talking to uh, my girlfriend. Yeah. yeah. So, just, what takes priority from those three? Um, well, of course, because my Nintendo Switch's battery dies fast, I have to play that, and then that's, that's on my hand. But when the notification comes that she's texting, I have to yeah. switch on that. And then the TV series is just there for me to like look down when the game is loading. Or has there has there ever been a time where you were so busy multitasking you forgot to reply and you got yes, it happens, it happens a lot. <laughs> Speaking of TV series, as you told me earlier, you like watching more of the light-hearted yes, shows. Yes. So, name some of your favorite TV series as of all time. So, of, of all time, all time. Like, let's say top, top three. Top three: How I Met Your Mother, um, Friends, and Modern Family. Okay. Oh shit! Wait, Big Bang Theory also. So, okay, let's make it top four. Yeah. Okay. I love Friends also, so I have to ask. Name your favorite Friends character. Phoebe. Phoebe! Phoebe! She's the best. Yeah. Wow! She makes me laugh the most. Interesting, yeah. interesting. See, I like Joey and those yeah. two like yeah. get along really well. <laughs> I just don't want to be a Ross, man. <laughs> yeah, neither do I. Okay, how about how I met your mother? Barney? No. Uh, maybe character in How I Met Your Mother would probably be Lily. Lily. Interesting. Yeah, Lily would probably be my favorite. Interesting. So, it's also funny because when you were a kid, you enjoyed going out and playing out more, but now I'm guessing you love your Nintendo Switch. Yes. What are your favorite games, go-to games? Legend of Zelda is my number one home. Oh my god, that's amazing. Have you played? Have you played? No, I'm not sure. But it's the best game I've ever played. I wasn't into the whole series of um, Legend of Zelda, but this game, wow, is amazing. Have you ever been a hardcore FIFA player? Okay. I am the number one Pokemon fan ever. I love. I actually only bought the Switch, and I bought my. I, I previously bought my Nintendo DS just to play Pokemon. So who did you choose? Bulbasaur, Squirtle, or Char? Oh, always the Fire Starter. Char it's Charmander or Torchic. Tor Tor it's always the Fire Starter. Awesome, awesome. What are the other things that? you like to do in your downtime because I'm sure as a student athlete like he said he has practices in the morning then he goes to class and you know you're busy with other stuff yeah. too I'm sure but when you have your downtime you know time to yourself what's your go-to not one thing because you like to multitask yeah. so what are your go-to things to do aside from what you mentioned um sleep <laughs> <laughs> Really at the moment, what I'm in, especially in college, what I find myself doing most of the time is um, getting back um, to sleep and resting because uh, it's tiring waking up early for training and then having to stay up for class. Do you also follow a specific diet or do you just burn everything? <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I've tried to follow a specific diet, I to gain weight. It's hard. It's mm -hmm. pretty difficult. So um, at the moment, like especially when it's season, I lay off from a lot of things, all the bad things. <laughs> like? Like, of course, no alcohol, not a lot of things, alcohol. Um, but I have wine occasionally, but not really. Yeah, for the fancy fans. Yeah, when I'm with my family, yeah. you know, like it was my, my cousin's dispute recently, so we had wine, um, me and my cousins, we had wine together. And then um, I treat myself to chips sometimes, but not all the time. And then. Um, Coke after after every game I make sure that I have at least one glass of Coke because I love Coke. Interesting. When well, was the first time you ever beat your dad one on one in basketball? Would I, you remember? I have never played my dad in one on one. Never. Yes, really? I have played with him for a father and son basketball tournament in, in Ateneo. Yeah. And that was a it was a fun but bad experience for me because 
Um, there was one fast break play where my dad rebounded the ball, threw it, and then I made the layup and I missed it. Oh. And until now, he never makes me forget that I missed one oh. open layup. So if you played it one on one right now, who would win? If I continue basketball, I think I have a chance. <laughs> but but that would always be that. <laughs> always be the really good basketball player. Anyways. Okay. This one is a. Uh... Not really important, I was going to say important to add weight to it, but I guess not so important, but fun question. Yeah. What's the one thing that people don't know about Harvey that you would like them to know? Well, one information was that I was a really big Pokemon fan, but what I want people to know... Yeah. No. Uh, I guess that... Uh, I'm a really friendly person. <laughs> like <laughs> I can attest to that. Like I don't. It's hard for me to stay to be exclusive or to at least uh, to not be open to hang out with all these different kind of people. Like in high school, I found myself situated with a lot of different people who have different specialties and a lot of different skills. Like I had uh, in our barcada, we were we we were we were all different in terms of our passion. You'd expect like someone, an athlete to be with athletes or football players to be with football players. But uh, that wasn't the case for me. I'd always be with um, different people from um, different uh, activities that they enjoy doing. So essentially, you're someone who likes to learn different things because like you said, you like to multitask, you like hanging out with different people. Yeah. So have you always considered yourself as someone who doesn't like being basically placed in just one spot or one team. Yeah. You like being on there. Yeah, that's pretty much who I am. Um, like in the team also, I, I consider everybody to be a close friend of mine. Like I, I'd be willing to do um, anything for them. I'd be willing to um, talk to whoever needs um, to talk to me or who needs someone to talk to. I'd always be there for any one of them. And um, it's a disclaimer that that's not me when I'm in the field. Like that's a whole different person. That's not that's not Harvey okay, also. Um, I feel like uh, the 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 person who is playing football is not the same person who you see in everyday life. Harvey Gayoso, amazing football player, <laughs> even better human being. <laughs> Thanks, Harvey. That Thank interview you very much. was legend. Wait for it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank, Thank you. Very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.